climate smart agriculture should translate to increased production, allowing communities to adapt to changing circumstances as a result of climate change, providing low carbon alternatives and building resilience to the impacts of climate change in small scale farming. However, a survey by the Rio Plus Center in partnership with FANAPAN in five countries in southern Africa, namely Lesotho, Mozambique, Swaziland, Zambia and Zimbabwe, found that women and men do not have equal access to support for climate smart agriculture. The survey also found that men and women approach and respond to climate related challenges differently. Respondents also said that more attention to gender was warranted. We need to make sure that if men and women are involved in agriculture, they both sets have the capacity to contribute to a better agricultural development, to better investment and to better output. And we have to understand and think about what does that mean? Does that mean that they're always different? Not necessarily, but we have to consider what those needs are. How are those needs different? What are the pressures that may differ in a female-headed household compared to a male-headed household? Looking at climate change issues from the perspective of both men and women has many benefits. It allows us to identify and respond to the needs and realities of people, allowing them to adapt their changing circumstances in a manner that suits them best, especially as smallholder farmers. In Mozambique, the feedback received suggested that equal access by men and women to technology, inputs and credit was as important as technology and politics for the next 10 years. We have long known that socially defined roles have led to women sometimes taking on work in agriculture that pays very little or nothing at all, such as processing, marketing and looking after small and large animals. As a result, their opinions on which technologies would be best are often not sought. Because these women are not involved in economic activity, they often look towards government and other public institutions for support to conduct their activities. FAO na Lucy Jeff. Oh, mine e gulimen nge gonga gong setile gakulu. E esmen selanga guti vilele a shisa al koni gona gasling. Oba koni le guti nshanye le lumbi la bese selam kati sin seng fagale tinshumai seng bisa luchan. Leti ke no maseli ni le le lemvula se hambil. Ngalog silanga pasi gun guna le tinshumai na luchan. Bese kila la umswaga mokondo si lumbi la koni kuzonda guti. Without, 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 without